What's up, YouTube? What's going on, man? No time, no see. But, uh, anyway, you know, back in my truck, making a video today. Because I feel like I ain't even made a video in a long time. I just want to uh, go back to my last video. My last video, I was highly intoxicated off the Hennessy. But what I said it was it had a lot of truth to it. Don't get me wrong. But for the time being, man, I think I'm trapped out here, man. I'm trapped on this OTR shit, man. I just felt a lot of applications back home. Had a couple of hits, man, but the money ain't making sense, man. If the money ain't making sense, I, I just can't do it, man. I ain't going to do it. I'm not trying to take a pay cut, man. I ain't, I ain't trying to take a pay cut, but... I see them near and there. Like I said, man, I think I'm trapped out here, man. That's the thing, man. You new guys, man, you come out here, man, get comfortable and get used to the the, um, the money you make, you know? You get used to it. Like, what job, like last week, I made 1400 some change on a week, um, for one week. What job back home are you going to make that type of money? And I'm company, mind you. I'm company, you know what I'm saying? I'm company, not least. I'm company. But what job back home, what regular job, nine to five job, what well, I think I'm going to, you know what I'm saying, do to make that type of money? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, this, the jobs I had calling me back back home, they wanted, they was like $16 an hour job, $15 an hour. Um, I'm not going there, man. I'm not, I'm not going in that type of category. It's not gonna happen, man. I'm not going down. I put too much hard work, you know what I'm saying, in this shit to be going down. I'm only going up from here, like you know what I'm saying. Like, uh, like my year anniversary is about to come up in a cup in like a month, a month or two. I'm probably like a month and a half. My year anniversary is about to come up, and. I feel good about that. You know what I'm saying? I really do. I mean, it was hard. I wanted to quit plenty of times. Because I'm going I'm to I'm tell you like this, man. This shit right here is just a job for me, man. I enjoy it sometimes. But most of the time, it's just a job, man. It's just a job. I'm not going to be one of them guys to be like, Oh, I'm so enjoying over the road. You see this, you see that. Man, you see you see the sights going 65 miles per hour. That's about it. So it's just a job for me. You know, wherever you stop is where you stop at. But, like I said, man, I'm coming up on my year anniversary, and I, I'm, I'm proud of that, man. A whole year with one company, you know, and I think that's a, a big, a big, a big achievement, you know, in this, in this OTR shit. A big achievement, and I think that's gonna look um, good, good on my resume, you know. I think it's gonna look good on my resume. But, but like I said, man. I think I'm trapped out here. I don't know. I don't know, man. I, I'm not settling for less, man. Because, I, like I said, I put too much hard work into this shit, man. To just settle, you know? So, so like I said, if I leave this company and it's not, you know, the money that I, that I, want, uh, that I want, I'm not going local. I'm not doing it. I'm just going to go to another OTR company that's paying more than the, the money I'm making now. That's the way I see it, man, you know? And this is what it is, you know? Like, like it's about money, man. Like, it's just about money, man. Just business at the end of the day. And I'm not gonna go. I'm not gonna go down. Cause, cause, I, cause I'm not. I'm not comfortable. Cause, because I want to go home every day. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. Fucking. Uh, how I say this? I'm not gonna. Just. Take, take a pay cut. I'm not, I'm not taking the pay cut. Basically. I'm not taking the pay cut. So, if I gotta stay OTR for two years, three years to find that job local that's paying me twenty something dollars better an hour, hey, that's that's what I gotta do. But I'm not I'm not going home and making no sixty dollars an hour, seven sixty dollars an hour, seventy dollars an hour. I'm not doing that shit. I'm not gonna, especially I live in Connecticut. They're gonna tax the shit out of me. So, basically. After it was all said and done every week, I'll probably making <laughs> after taxes and all, probably 
taken after probably net but like four hundred five hundred dollars that's fucking ridiculous man that's fucking i can't see myself going back to that man i can't see myself going back to that that's not gonna happen man i'm used to making eight nine thousand thousand dollar checks like i said last week i made fourteen hundred some change no bullshit no fucking bullshit. I made fourteen hundred some goddamn change. I mean, I hit I hit all the bonuses and all the you know what I'm saying all the little incentives and shit. So that's why I kind of was kind of heavy like that. But yeah, man. And I'm a rookie. Let's like just put that out there. So you can all my new drivers coming in. Find that good company, man. You know, find that good company that's gonna pay. Don't settle, especially if you went to a, a credible school. Don't settle for the bullshit company, man. If you don't come out here. Don't get me wrong. I ain't jump when I first came out here. I wasn't making that type of money. I'm not gonna lie to you. I had to prove myself to these people. I had to prove myself. I had to, you know, I had to build myself up to make the type of money I'm making now. But when it's all said and done. It was worth it. Like I said, man, I've been in this company almost a year, man, and I'm, I'm proud of myself, man. But I'm not gonna keep you guys too long, man. You know, I just want to make a video. Cause I made that bullshit video last time. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna take it down. I'm gonna leave it up there. You know, they say uh, a drunk mind speaks a sober, sober, sober. Um, a drunk tongue speaks a sober mind. I guess that's that's my sober, sober mind. Whatever, you know how it goes. But anyway, I was very intoxicated that last video. You know, you can see it. You know, I was very drunk. I just was, I was in my feelings. You know. Because I stayed out, you know what I'm saying, almost a month. And the company wouldn't let me stay home as much time I wanted to stay home. But that's all right. It's also all cool, man. Like I said, man, it's only business, man. It's only business, you know. They want this truck moving. They want to move freight. That's just the name of the business, man. If the truck ain't moving, they ain't making money. So it is what it is, man. Like I said, man.